All right, Leo, what's happening behind the scenes with your person? Behind the scenes with your person. And we're going to see if they're going to come back. Especially if you want them to come back. Behind the scenes of your person. What's happening? We got the Ten of Swords. So, some of you guys, your person feels betrayed because of the ending. Some of you guys' person could be playing victim, but at the same time, they're not ready to make change. This is somebody that don't want to reinvent themselves. They don't want to make change, but they feel betrayed. They're trying to hide the simple fact that they are heartbroken, but it is saying that behind the scenes, Leo, your person feels stabbed in the back, which is betrayed. They don't want to make change, and they could be holding some form of resentment within them. It's because... This is somebody that is heartbroken low-key. Yes, they may try to act like they okay, but no, they're heartbroken inside. They're just, I'm hearing growing mad, growing angry behind the scenes. So let's keep it moving and see what else is taking place with your person. What else is happening with Leo's person behind the scenes besides them feeling betrayed and even if they're not playing victim, you know what I'm saying? They just, this is how they feel. They feel betrayed. You know, they may, they're not taking action right now because um, at the moment, they, they're going through some things, you know, internally and outside of their life. But they trying to keep it a secret, Leo, because we got the high priestess right here next to the Ten of Swords. Yes, they feel hurt, you know, and um, they're trying to keep it to themselves how they feel. Yes, this person is devastated right now about an ending but it has something to do with them not being able to make a change your person don't want to change some of y'all could be somebody that don't believe in the creator like they don't believe in god you know but it seems like stuff is hitting the fan in their life like things are crumbling and there ain't a lot of shock about it they really is they secretly going through a massive ending right now a massive transformation in their life but spirit is trying to get them to change but it's saying that they don't want to change you know they too because it's some this one could be somebody that's very stubborn um maybe they have some control a lot of controlling behavior about them they could be mad right now about everything they're mad because you have gained some form of discipline within yourself and they just could be mad about you know the forced change changes that they are going through right now and um i'm just getting this energy where some of y'all's person probably look at you at fault but it's saying this person is secretly going through a lot of endings and um i just felt like that they're trying to control they're trying to have control they're trying to have the upper hand about all these changes that's going on in their life right now but they're mad they're definitely mad um some of you guys person could be hurt about a, um, a company or like I said whether they have a business or or maybe they have a business with you I don't know but it's in that they're trying to gain some form of control over everything around them but let's see because y'all know energy always change so let's see what else is taking place yeah, this person is devastated though they really is they have a lot of ang pent up anger within them Leo So we got make it work. We got independence. And then we have the future. So we're going to clarify these cards, Leo. Clarify, make it work, independence, and the future spirit. Clear intuitive messages, please, for my videos and they love entrance. Okay, yeah. All right, so we got the six of swords reversed. Yeah, this person is having a hard time to, um, I'm hearing grasp reality like they having a hard time of, of gaining control of their life you know it's like the more they try to you know work 
for something that they want or try to gain something, the more upset that they become. They're just not at peace. They cannot move on. They feel stuck. They feel stuck in whatever environment that they could be in right now. I'm just getting this energy where things are just secretly falling apart in their life. The more they try to force something to work in their favor, the more they left on their own. You know what I'm saying? It's like they feel like they have no control over themselves or no control over their lives. So at this point, this is somebody that's on their own. They independent right now, you know, and all they can do is rely on themselves. Purposely, spirit is trying to get this person to rely on themselves and not try to have other people help them. You know what I'm saying? It's like helpless energy. Your person is feeling helpless right now. I'm just going to be real with y'all. We got the high priestess reverse. But there is something that is going to be revealed with, with, within your person. It has to do with them in their future, Leo. It's about their independence and it's about their future. Maybe they're starting to get a clear understanding of why things could be the way that they are. And it has something to do with their future. Yeah, this person is aware that they're going through bad karma. Look, your person is highly aware that they are going through bad karma. Some of y'all know this person is going through bad karma. Some of you guys know this, but you could be keeping to yourself. Maybe you are somebody who is very psychic. Maybe you could be somebody who's very intuitive. Maybe you know that your person is going through some bad karma. But somebody is devastated that they are on their own. And they know that they are going through bad karma. So no matter who tries to help your person, it won't work out in their favor. It won't. That's what I'm seeing. They try to, no matter who your person try to hang on to, whether this is a relationship or whether this is them trying to fall, like find a job or whatever, or trying to find a work, trying to find a way to make some money, it it it, it breaks. It, I'm hearing it detaches from them. Like it, it it doesn't matter. Like it don't work out. It's like they always find a way to be on their own. Like it's like they know. They're on their own. You know what I'm saying? No matter what they do, it's, it's like it, it don't work out in their favor. And it is saying that this is not no secret. So a lot of people know that your person is struggling around them, Leo. A lot of people around them, like their friends, their family members, or whoever, these people know that your person life is falling apart and they're going through some bad karma. Because maybe they know your person is a, is a, is a piece of work. Maybe they know that. You know, they know that your person is hard-headed because I'm getting this hard-headed energy, probably stubborn, and um, could be very controlling at times. But I just feel like Spirit is trying to push this person to be independent and look towards their future so they can have a better life, Leo. But they refuse to make change. I'm just getting this stubborn energy. They too stubborn to make change, Leo. And like I said, no matter who helps them, this person they still end up not happy. They still end up finding it very hard to make things come together for them. And it's because this person knows they under, a, I'm hearing, some of y'all this person is under a spell. I, exactly what I just heard. Some of you guys, this person is under some form of a spell. Maybe somebody cursed this person's life. This per that's all I keep hearing, curse, spell, curse, spell. Your person is uh, under some form of a curse, Leo. Because we got the creator reverse. And I'm hearing it's because this is somebody I don't believe in spirit. This is somebody I don't believe in God. I'm hearing atheist. Maybe somebody could be an atheist. But it's saying that they don't want to change. They don't want to change their 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 way, their view on things. They have a, a messed up heart within them. Like they could be very, you know, holding up, holding within a lot of resentment, a lot of they make they play victim a lot, even though they know that they are the reason of their own downfall, Leo. They make it seem like everybody is everybody um fault that they are in the predicament that they could be in right now, Leo. You see what I'm saying? And like I said, they they try to grasp control over over their life and reality, but they they just won't wake up. They just won't wake up, Leo. They try to control their future. 
But some of you guys, they, maybe they are psychic themselves. And I'm hearing some of y'all's person probably have gifts, but they could be afraid of their own gifts, Leo. Maybe they're so stubborn. They, maybe they always tell themselves, I don't believe in God. You know, none of this and that and the third. I'm just getting this energy where they they see their future. They, I'm hearing this is somebody that's thinking negative about themselves. They're thinking negative about their future. Like they they just could be a negative thinker. Maybe everything that they come out their mouth could be negative. I'm hearing that also. But this is somebody that has a lot of pent up hurt inside of them, Leo. And they're trying to grasp, you know, reality. Like they're trying to have control over their life, Leo. They're trying to hold, could have control over their life because they feel like their future is bad karma. Some of you guys, this person is very cursed. I'm just going to be honest. With these cards right here, it's telling me your person is under a spell. They under some point. Somebody cursed this person. Or they cursed their own self and it backfired. Whatever they, if they tried to curse you or if they tried to curse somebody else, just know that whoever they did wrong in the past, it backfired and it came tenfold. Because that's exactly what I'm getting. Their future is under... A lot of bad karma. From here on out, Leo, your person, they're going to be suffering. They got to suffer throughout the rest of their life, Leo. Literally. And it's just like they're walking around like they're walking around life with a dark cloud over them. That's exactly what I'm feeling. Like this darkness right here. It's just their future is dark. It's dark. And then we got the Wheel of Fortune reversed. Nothing is going in this person's favor. Nothing. When I say nothing is going in this person's favor, like, this is, they got to suffer for the rest of their life. This is their karma. They're under a curse, Leo. They're under a spell, Leo. And I got a feeling this is somebody that tried to curse other people and put this energy on other people. And instead of making change, they decided to try to put it on other people. But it backfired tenfold. I'm hearing that your person is suffering from all the BS that they have put other people through. So if your person hurt you, they hurt somebody else before you, or even somebody else before that other person, or even somebody else and so on before you, I'm hearing that your person is suffering the consequences right now. They got to live with that dark cloud over their life for the rest of their life, Leo. Like, literally. It's like they're trying to control their future, but it's it's nothing's going to work for them. Nothing's going to work for them, Leo. And you want to know why? Because this is somebody that knows they belong to you, Leo. We got the Hierophant right here. They know that they belong to you. And they refuse to see that they belong to you because they is filled with so much hurt and pain. And I'm hearing funky attitude, just very stubborn always think the world is like against them or you know but in reality this is somebody that has hurt other people and it's like they don't want to acknowledge the simple fact that they have hurt other people so they blame the world for their problems but this is somebody that knows they belong to you leo they know that they they know they belong to you but i feel like you have already got over this person Due to them trying, didn't I say some of y'all's person tried to put something on you, but it backfired, Leo. They tried to put some spell work on you. They tried to curse your life, Leo, but it backfired. And now they stuck. This is a commitment that they are stuck in. That curse backfired. Some of y'all reversed that curse onto them, Leo. And now your person is just, they didn't get away with it. Seven of Swords reversed, they did not get away with deceiving you. They did not get away with trying to curse you. Their whole life is based on bad luck. I'm going to be real with y'all. And some of y'all could be feeling a bit guilty about it. But don't feel bad because they ain't feel bad about trying to mess up your life. But it's saying that y'all have already got unstuck about this person. Y'all don't miss this person no more like you used to. You don't yearn for this person anymore. Like, it's because, once again, the minute you stop yearning for them, the minute you stop loving them, the minute you stop um, missing them, that's when they get their karma. They don't get away with it. Look, it backfired because you broke free. You broke free. And it's sad to say because... 
This person knew that y'all belong together. You were supposed to change. When you came into this person's life, Leo, you were supposed to change this person's life. But they refused to change because they were so stubborn and they was they was so they was already when you met this person, this person was already hurt about other things. You know what I'm saying? This is somebody that has not never healed. But it's like when you came into your life, oh, H E L L, it broke loose. It broke loose. Because spirit don't play about you. Spirit do not play about you at all. Because I feel like y'all came into this person's heart, life, Leo, with an open heart. For real, for real. Out of all the people that they have ever dealt with, I feel like you're the only person that was real to them. You're the only person that's, that, was, that was committed to this person, even when you wasn't with them, Leo. It's like you still was helping them. You still was giving them stuff. You still was showing love, even after they probably dogged you out. You see what I'm saying? And because of that, you never changed. You know what I'm saying? You never changed who you were as a person, even after all of this. I'm telling you, spirit made this person suffer. Now they got to walk through life with this dark cloud over, over them because of the way they treated you and everybody else. But I'm here. But when they met you, things never went the same way in this person's life no more. Things never changed for the better when they met you, Leo. It's like... As soon as they met you, their life never went back to normal. Never. And it, it took you to remove yourself from this person and unlove this person and detach and stop missing them in order for them to get their karma. That's exactly what I just heard. But it's saying that this they got to do the work on their own. Spirit's trying to get this person to be on their own and stop depending on everybody else to help them all the time, Leo. This person is helpless. It's getting to the point they are helpless because no matter what they do or who tries to help them, it's going to crumble. They know this. They will never be at peace. Because this person's mind is already made up themselves that they're going to forever face bad karma. Some of those person know that they don't deserve a good life because they know they have done wrong to other people. That's exactly what I just heard. This is somebody that got their mind made up. Some of y'all, this could be a Leo. I'm just getting Leo energy. I'm just getting stubborn energy. Or it could be an Aries or a Scorpio. Some of y'all, this could be a Gemini or a water sign. I'm seeing water. But this is somebody that got their mind made up to already because they know that they their life is going to be forever full of hardships and they will never be able to recover from anything. Because of what the pain and suffering that they put amongst you and everybody else that they dealt with before you. That's exactly what I just heard. We got message from Spirit. Spirit been trying to get this person to act to, to wake up. But it's also telling me that y'all already know that this person is going through bad karma. You already know because you tapped in, Leo. You ain't even got to see nothing. You just know. Some of y'all probably did see some things. Some of y'all did see some things. Spirit's trying to get this person to wake up, but they just, they so conflicted and hurt. It's like they refuse to look at the other side. You know, it's like they know what's up. They know they belong to you, but they don't want to, to belong to anybody. This is somebody who's very selfish, somebody who is very self-centered. They got this, it's me, 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 me attitude. I'm here, me against the world. Well, they ain't got no choice but to be going against the world now because ain't nobody... Spirit is not going to allow nothing to go in this person's favor as long as somebody is helping them, Leo. They're trying to push this person in a direction to help themselves. You know, look, you ended this. Like I said, y'all already know. Y'all got y'all messages from spirit that your person is going through things. But it's saying that y'all have already gained y'all closure with this situation and closed out this cycle. I feel like a lot of y'all is chilling right now. You going about your life. And if you somebody that have gifts, like you could be psychic or whatever, you know in your heart that... This is the person, but you know that you can't be with them. It's sad. You have to close this cycle out. This is your divine masculine, but they need to change. I feel like you have already changed. If anything, you have already been the same, but you could be a better person than you was before. You see what I'm saying? 
But it's sad to say that y'all have to close this cycle out with this divine masculine because they can be your divine masculine, but all it requires for them to do is make this change and wake up, right? Only them, only they can do this. But if not, spirit giving you somebody else. So it don't even matter. People can be replaced. They can. Because I feel like a lot of y'all felt like this person. I'm hearing twin flame. If you believe in twin flame, some of y'all felt like this person is your twin flame. Some of y'all felt this person is your divine masculine or your divine feminine. But spirit is about to wrap that out because close that cycle out with this person because they're not going to change. And they got to suffer for the rest of their life. So they're going to give you somebody else. They're going to give you your true love. They're going to give you your divine masculine or your divine feminine. Somebody that's going to treat you right. You see what I'm saying? So I'm hearing that your divine your other half whoever you consider this person is they being replaced with a divine masculine a better person leo it's going to be pop up in your life but i'm gonna go ahead and end it right here leo i hope it resonates with you guys and y'all take care